Today, one of the most important buildings in the entire valley is fulfilling a very important task. But the convention center isn't boosting business, it's vaccinating people. Hector Mejia live there right now with details on this new second dose facility. Hector, good afternoon. And this is a push to administer more second doses of the COVID-19 vaccine, but you must be eligible and have an appointment, otherwise you will be turned away. The convention here is only for those who got the first dose through the Southern Nevada Health District or its partners, the convention center. And so far, fewer than one and a half percent of all adults across Nevada have been fully vaccinated against COVID-19. The health district says Nevada receives about 30,000 doses a week from the federal government. Up to 25,000 of that is given to the health district, but that's not enough to keep up with demand. That's according to officials at the health district. And we've heard from people who say they have not been able to make an appointment or that the next available date is past the time they should be getting the second dose. I asked the health district just how widespread that problem is and what they're doing to fix it. Right now, with limited supply of vaccine, it's very widespread. I mean, really, we can only set up appointments and release enough appointments for the amount of vaccine that we have on hand. Um, as you've seen across the country and other states and jurisdictions where they booked out appointments for weeks and weeks and weeks, didn't have enough vaccine to provide that. The health district adds appointments are limited because they are allocated based on shipments, which could change weekly. So they recommend for you to keep checking the website repeatedly. And we also learned that FEMA is on hand, but in a supporting role. Reporting from the Las Vegas Convention Center, Hector Mejia, 8 News Now.